Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 edition. Page 419. Common brain lesions. What are the consequences of amygdala lesions bilaterally? If there is a amygdala lesion bilaterally, it can lead to Kluver-Busey syndrome. What is Kluver-Busey syndrome? Kluver-Busey syndrome is a condition in which the individual will have hyperorality, which means they would talk a lot, hypersexuality, and would have disinhibited behavior. What condition can lead to amygdala lesion? Amygdala lesion can happen due to herpes simplex virus 1. What are the consequences of the frontal lobe lesion? If the frontal lobe is lesion, it can lead to disinhibition and deficits in concentration, orientation, and judgment. With frontal lobe lesion, there can also be re-emergence of primitive reflexes. What is the consequence of right parietal lobe lesion? If there is a lesion to the right parietal lobe, it can lead to spatial neglect syndrome, in which there would be agnosia of the contralateral side of the world. So basically, you would not be able to recognize the contralateral side. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.